<laughs> People ask, what's the, the biggest difference well, from the pandemic that you've noticed? Right, so that one's easy. That one's easy. The biggest thing I've noticed is men are washing their hands. That is, you know, ladies, i got to be honest with you, we weren't. Uh, we were lying. We were like, uh, we pretended sometimes, but we were not washing our hands. That changed. The pandemic changed us as men. And we resisted. We resisted as men for a while. Like, nah, this is we'll do a quarantine, we'll make a man away, whatever it is, we'll be fine. Then they took sports away. That changed it. They're like, whoa, 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 the college basketball is gone? This is madness! We will wash our hands, whatever it takes. Please don't take sports away. Change happened. So men are washing their hands. We're not washing our masks. But one thing is <laughs> progress is slow, ladies. Progress is slow. But uh, we, we recently opened the office back up, going back in to work. Not a lot of coworkers wanted to come back. And I was like, why why, why do you want to work at home? They're just like, ugh, pants. <laughs> Disease, like, oh, jeans, am I right? <laughs> been a year and a half, and who knows if they fit? <laughs> like, oh, we've got a lot of Zoom meetings. Uh, we're worried at this point. But we, I went back into the office, and first question out of my boss's mouth Hey, how was the pandemic? <laughs> terrible. It was a terrible pandemic. No one had a good pandemic. I don't understand how that question is even coming up. Unless your, unless your name was Jeff Bezos or Kamala Harris, oh, you had a terrible okay. pandemic. No one, no one had a good pandemic. Maybe this kid, but other than that, You guys are so off the hook. I thought, I don't, I'm not going to lean on you at all. You guys are like, I don't have time. You know what? Like this. It is. No, I know. I know. I know. But, but yeah, 2020, pandemic year, not a great year. I think, I think the proudest thing I can say about 2020 is I never, Use DoorDash or Uber Eats one time through the whole pandemic. Not one time. Thank you. Yeah. I don't understand how that was the time for that to blow up. I don't know. Like, we're in a pandemic. The last thing I want is another pair of underpaid, underqualified hands touching my food. I don't understand. How that. We're like, disease is rampant. Could you please bring me my Chick fil A? I, uh... I would rather pay an Uber to take you to Five Guys just to watch everything go down. Just to make sure everything's on the up and up. He sneezed, start over! Like, <laughs> I'm that guy. I'm definitely that guy. And this is how I know I don't like DoorDash. This is how I know I'm not in on the DoorDash. I don't understand anything about the whole concept of it. But they lost me when they're like, hey, first delivery's free. First one's on us. Give us a try. You don't have to worry about paying. We'll take care of you. And I refuse to support a company that has the same business model as drug dealers. <laughs> 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 I'm not tricking you with that one again. <laughs> <laughs> Stay in school. 